Marathon Bahamas is almost here and its organizers at Sunshine Insurance are looking for volunteers. We're going to need close to 400 people out on that course on February 14th. We're going to need people to help with water, to help with medical, to help with traffic management, etc, etc. So even if you're not considering running in the marathon, call us at Marathon Bahamas. Go to marathonbahamas.com or call us at 502 6500 and sign up to volunteer. Marathon Bahamas President Brian Moody says that they have reached out to the ministries of health and education and are encouraging schools to come up with teams made up of students and or faculty. He says that even if you don't have a team, contact the event's organizers and they will gladly find one for you. We've got a full marathon running on February 14th. We've got simultaneously a half marathon for those people who can't run 26.2 miles. It's 13.1 mile, miles. And finally, we've got a relay marathon where if you can get a team together of six people, each of you will be running somewhere between four to five miles each and we'll have a relay all the way around the course. Director of Sports Tourism, Tyrone Sawyer, says that his department sees the upcoming Marathon Bahamas as an opportunity to establish a long-term partnership for what he hopes will become an iconic tourism event. What we have sought to do is to join hands with the organizers of the marathon and seek to use our relationships with the various airlines, with the various tour operators, knowing full well that with the short lead time, it may not accrue fully for the first event, but certainly as we go on, we're going to end up with what we believe will become an iconic event that would stimulate quite a bit of inbound tourism to the Bahamas. Sunshine Bahamas plans to make this an annual event and has brought in executives from the Association of International Marathon Runners who have officially measured the course being used by Marathon Bahamas on February 14th. This means that Marathon Bahamas will now also be a qualifying marathon for some of the biggest marathons in the world, including the New York Marathon and the Boston Marathon. For the Tourism Today Network, I'm Gina Seeley.